Hi everyone, I'm Kristen Burt with Legal Media TV's Red Carpet Report. Tonight we're at the premiere of Curse, and we're going to find out what three adjectives describe tonight's resume. I don't want to do that. Alright, we've got Jeffrey King. You didn't talk to me. Yeah. Yeah. Alright, we've got Jeffrey New here with me. He's the director of Curse. Uh, tell us how you came upon this project. The long way to start here, I saw Yuri crossing the street and left with him to his car bar. And I walked over and started talking to him and I thought he was not dead. And he ended up being friends. And he was going by and he called me and he said, I would have to do this red thing that I wrote. And he helped me. But I wasn't doing it. And I just kept looking for it. I don't know if you have a little bit of a story of a uh, single mom who's also an assassin. And I thought that's, that's very interesting. Someone who juggles a career of uh, loving and assassination. With a son, you know, you know, why are you going to be here? Because you should be more getting ready for school. Then there was the other level that he's a fallen angel and he's trying to fight your way back to the gentry, that is fascinating, drug dealers or whatever. I thought, I'm not sure I understand that, but I really understand the human level of it. So I said, look, you know, I, I like the way that you've written and I can help you. And, you know, as long as I don't have to totally understand it, I'll do it. <laughs> Well, I understand it. No, that's good, though. I mean, have you worked in that series before? Because it really is such a different format. Yeah, I never did. I never did. I mean, I keep you know, hearing about how this is a new thing, and maybe it's the future, so I want to try it. Mostly I've done features and some TV, and I've just got it, and, you know, I've got a movie in Russia, but I, I, I never did a web thing before. So coming from your feature film and television, what did you find challenges in terms of directing? Uh, no time, no money. Um, but other, other than that, nothing. I mean, it was like we, we, we shot this, so my first year was, it's a movie. And we shot it, and we shot it with two cameras because we were able to do it faster. And we found this two camera and we were willing to work, you know, for the budget, which is almost nothing. Everybody really takes in and work really hard, and we shot it all in one day. And uh, I took a look at it, it looks really good. And uh, it was a challenge. I mean, it's, it's, when you make movies for studios, the challenge is spending lots of money in a, in a wise way. When you do an independent work and start it, the challenge is you have no money, and how can you make it good that you have money? Every dollar matters, and you want to make it look it's all about preparation and you know, knowing what you need and what you got to do and a few tricks. What's the one really good trick of that for shooting up for web series? The web series? Shoot with long lenses. So they have the texture to it as opposed to wide lenses with just kind of crappy and video. So that's one thing. Uh, and I don't know if that's what web series are about because I've never done one, but. I don't think it's like a movie. So that's one thing. And the other thing is really prepare because usually you have no money and you have to move so fast that you have to think it through and get it in your head many times before you get there. I can't think of that thing today. That's quarter to the most questions. It was longer. I bet it was. I bet it was longer than five, six hours. Uh, it, was like, it was like a four to six hours. You really was great. Like, I was very impressed with her. He wrote this thing, he started this thing, he basically produced this thing, and had no money because he was doing everything by uh, either getting favors or convincing people that this is a good opportunity. And it was, it was impressive. And he followed through with it and hung in there, you know, I mean, I had a lady before it. And then I thought that maybe nothing would ever happen with it, but now she said something happened with it. It's exciting to see you. I'm looking forward to seeing more. He's impressive. All right, one final question. You're asking everyone to describe her in three words. Let me do it. Uh, human drama, mystical. Okay, I'll take that. I'm 
I'm collecting all the attitudes together and the nouns, which is a little foreign to me. My hands were all I was doing. Good actors working on that story. And now that was like seven. 